Right there you go. Now what I'm here, right? So his goal is this to not take a step. Right? But what I do is I feel his empty space. Where it is, it's going. If I have like this, right? And I don't do anything. So now I'm going to do a lot of here. Yeah, you do whatever you want. Now, the other so now, side, see, he's like laying this way. See, he push. Oh, you said you do whatever you want with the hand. Go ahead. Go ahead. Go ahead. You can do it. Go ahead. Throw it on Now you go right into the ground here. You got it. 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 Right here, broke. Now it pulls it out, but it's already broke. We're not laughing at you. <laughs> oh, no, that's all right. So, that's freestyle pushing. I know it's a little different. It's a little bit different approach, okay? Um, understand that with the push hands, this is not how I would fight. Okay? Fighting separate. Push hands is about developing skill and practice. If we were going to fight, very different. Okay? It doesn't look anything like that. This is like wrestling. It's for fun. Real fight? Nothing like that. So, so just so you're clear on that. So a guy could come in, he could be good in push hands, does not translate into combat. Unfortunately, a lot of guys that think they're good at push hands think that means they can fight. It doesn't mean that anything. It's like a guy who thinks he wins karate trophies in a tournament, he thinks he can fight for real. Not necessarily. All right? So just keep that. push hands. Here, see how it feels like it's already behind you. As soon as you make contact with me, you feel how your feet went like that. You felt like you wanted to go flying because the power is already behind you. You feel it. You feel it's behind you, right? It's too big. You can't handle it. Right? But how much is my arm moving? So now when I move in here, I go like that, and I issue as as he's coming in with the punch, he goes flying. So one of the concepts is is I imagine comes back to being able to use your imagination. I imagine and visualize that I'm putting the energy behind him. So when he's punching at my head and I come in here, if I if I if I push here, power here. So if Aaron resists, and I push, resist, only push it. So he can fight that power is here on him. But I don't put the power on him. His body's irrelevant. He's caught in a gearbox. I can't get the power behind him. I can't handle it. 